Weather Authority forecast is brought to you by Dorset Automotive. All the Hyundais, Nissans, and Mitsubishis at the Dorset Auto Park, US 41 South, Terre Haute. Now, your local weather authority with meteorologist Dan Reynolds. Well, Sunday, the better of the weekend days as we warmed up to 63. That's where we're at right now, 45 the low. Pretty close to those averages of 68 and 45. Beautiful sunny skies today as you look at the Gerber Post Buildings with the cam over downtown. Clear tonight. It's going to be a comfortable night. A lot of sunshine to start the day tomorrow. School day forecast, 7 o'clock for Terre Haute. Ah, sunrise 658 will be clear, 43 degrees. Not a bad day. Here's what we're tracking on the weather headlines. Warm and breezy on Monday. Gust of 30. One day only. The 80s return. And we'll see some midweek rain. Right now in Terre Haute, 64. 32 is the dew point. Nice and low. Humidity is down to 38%. Pressure steady at 30.07. Pretty comfortable day out there. Hit 42 at Paris. 43 at Terre Haute. 41 in Robinson, Mattoon. 39 at Crawfordsville. I thought somebody might drop into the upper 30s. And then look at that. 67 at Vincennes. So very mild day. The 65 over at Effingham, Bloomington at 64. Tim's right now north to south, Paris 61, Casey 62. Bloomington's checking in at 63 and only 65 along with Effingham. Winds light. They'll be out in the northeast tonight. Nothing to stir up the atmosphere much. Metro view. You can see some clouds back to the west, but I think the models are overdoing that. We've got nothing but clear skies out here, close to us anyway. No concerns overnight. No concerns to start the day. Tuesday late maybe a shower midnight or after right now we're waiting for that system to form up out to the west and move our way you can see as we zoom in uh, cloud cover up to the north a little bit of rain up there dissipating around chicago six hour satellite and radar loop nothing close to us severe weather outlook well nothing today obviously with that setup maybe wednesday we'll keep an eye on that now future cast overdid it again on the clouds we just don't have the cloud cover out there we got a lot of uh, clear skies we'll have that tonight now, as we go late Monday night overnight into Tuesday, we will start to see some clouds return. That's in advance of that next system that's going to move in and bring us showers with maybe a few thunderstorms as we get into Wednesday going into Thursday. Next nine days, we'll just let it roll through. Dry so far, then here comes Wednesday. A little line of showers and storms right there. So we'll keep tabs on that Wednesday night into early Thursday morning. Once that batches through, I think we'll hold off on rain. The models now are taking the rain out for next weekend. Substituting sunshine, so that looks good. Green shading is the warm weather, pretty much sticks around. After that one day in the 80s, we'll cool back down a little bit, have some 60s, but everything is going to be seasonal for the most part. So really not a bad week coming up. Been a very dry April. We're well below average for the year and the month, so we could use some rain by the middle part of the week. 42 tonight. That'll be under clear skies, just a light east wind. And then tomorrow, look at that, as you head back to work or school. 76 for the high, breezy with gusts from the south up to 30 miles an hour, and those gusts are going to help pump that temp up to 76. And then, look at Tuesday. Even with the cloud cover, it's going to be 83 degrees. That's well shy of a record high, though. That's 89. Then the front moves in, so we'll see showers likely with a few thunderstorms Wednesday. We'll keep tabs on that Wednesday afternoon into the evening, maybe early Thursday, a rumble of thunder. After that, we cool off 66, pretty close uh, to norm for this time of year. And we'll keep the showers in there, at least for the time being. Those taper off as we go through the day. Good timing, though. Look at all the sunshine Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We warm back to the 70s by the weekend. Omar's back with sports right after this.